What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Mike Rich, man. What's happening with y'all today? Beautiful day outside. I am in sunny Florida. Oh, yeah, Destin Bull. Yeah. We are in Destin, Florida at the Nike Outlets. What's the name of this outlet? It's a Prime Premium? I think it's a Premium Outlet. Premium Silver Sand or something. Premium Silver Sand Outlets. They have a Nike, they have a Lids locker room. They got a uh, heel figure back there. They got Reebok, they got Saucony. Hopefully we can find some hotness, some dopeness, and some cleansed activity in this outlet. Let's see what they got, man. Oh, by the way, today I got on a uh, great t-shirt, eight and nine joggers, and Jordan 11 low IEs. Red and black, red, white, and black guys. I know y'all gonna hate on them. Go and say what you got to say. But they fresh. So already, before I even get into it, this outlet ain't got nothing but running shoes, Jack. That's all I see. Air Max. You got free runs. People be saying their outlets don't get much. I guess this is what they mean. Uh, you got some... Okay, some of those fly knit. Uh, racers, bruh, got some Presto. Never a bad idea to cop Prestos. These are brown, look like it, for eighty bucks, get full size run. I just got so many Prestos that look like that. Um, they got these right here. I might get these for my wife. She loves Harachis. Do they have her size? Nope, they don't have her size. She wears a eight in men's. They don't have our size. Damn it. Yeah, they do. Right down. Yeah, they do. They right down. What size? What? Oh, $74. Let me see if my wife wants these. They might be a, like a manly, a manly color. I don't know. Let's see if she want them. Of course, they got all these utility Air Force Ones. Uh, even $69. Like, I think those were a failed experiment right now. Like I said, um, I have some of the best outlets in my area in it. At Locust Grove, Georgia, that outlet is better than most of the ones I go to when I go out of town, man. I mean, it's just, it's just, it's not like it's a bad outlet. It's just a bunch of running shoes, though. That's usually what outlet have. And they have some basketball sneakers and stuff like that, too. But you ain't going to find no retros or no Air Max. Not no OG Air Max. Just more of the newer, like, running style sneakers. They got, like, a lot of SBs. Um, they got these uh, Kobe ADs right here. 109 got another colorway not a big fan of those i got to carry fours for 94 dollars i uh, carry threes my bad um lebron soldiers got some lebron 14 lows they got some all uh, lebron 14 breads in here i like this shoe when it first released 129 is still too much for that i pay like 80 bucks for that shoe i probably won't even do that uh, <laughs> they got slides on deck. My wife just bought a pair of those yesterday. Uh, some more SBs. Just not a lot going on, y'all. I apologize because I thought they would have more. These are dope. For $89, this ain't bad for this shoe. Not too bad. They got dad shoes, Monarch guys. What's up with the dad shoes lately, man? People been, people been wanting the dad shoes lately. Oh, these are fresh, bro. These right here are fresh, man. These blue ultra fly knit 90s, man. These fresh, right? Those are clean. Yeah, those ain't bad. Then they got the brown, the gray. Those need to be that price. <laughs> yep. Uh, these are dope too for eighty nine dollars. Nice little dope colorway. I said nothing that I would be like, okay, let me jump and go in and get this nigga. Slim Pickens McGlickens. Man. Uh, yeah, not really my swag. But Nike didn't have nothing. Everybody is like running shoes everywhere. Which makes sense because since we've been down here, all we've seen is people running back and forth, up and down the road. Wait, wait. All right, we're in uh, Lids, uh, Lids locker room. Have the Pippin All Star. This is the All Star John I was talking about when I was talking about the cones. 
Which is nice. The Air Max 98 cone and they might go to South Beaches too. The Air Max 98 South Beach. Yeah. I think the cones, yeah, because the black and the orange, yeah. Well, and then they have a short, well, those are the wrong shorts, but this is the jersey I was talking about. Seems like they only got Scotty, Scotty Pippen. Um, they got some old school All Star Isaiah Thomas, like very old school All Michelin Ness action. Got the Vince Carter All Star joint. That is dopeness. This is the Willie Beeman joint from um the movie. Uh, what was the name of that movie with Jamie Fox? Uh, Any given Sunday. Yeah, Willie Beeman. Of course, they got the throwback football joints. Dan Marino, Bo Jackson, Aitman. I think that's pretty much it, though. I was looking for the basketball shorts, the NBA shorts, but I didn't see any except for those uh, Grizzlies, Vancouver Grizzlies on it. They also got the uh, Raptors sitting behind. One of the sevens. So, in a desperate attempt to find anything in this outlet, because I'm not seeing anything. I'm going to Adidas, man. Y'all know I'm desperate if I'm going to Adidas. Let's see if Adidas has anything of note. It's crazy, because I remember at one point, not too long ago, you would not be able to find Adidas Boost, NMDs and stuff like that in Adidas. They're $100, a guy. Look at those down there, 100 bucks. What are these right here? Rooster? Adidas shell toe joints. What's the rooster, man? What that mean? It says Superstar 80s CNY. Oh, Chinese New Year. Must have been a year of the rooster. What the inside look like? I know I probably got something crazy going on. Yeah. Yep, got that. Got a Chinese like pattern going on in there. Year of the rooster. Face that. Of course, you got your superstars in various colorways. Got this $30 Stan Smith right here that look like it's made of ostrich. Ostrich action Stan Smith. 29. Man, gotta get out of Adidas. My skin is starting to itch. Start, my skin is starting to itch. The, the, I think I got an allergic reaction to Adidas, man. The three stripes, man. It does it to me. So I'm in Ralph Lauren now. I think I find me a hat. I think this is a winner. First thing, babes. I like it. Wifey likes it. Has the um, the Hwasi right there in the back. Leather strap. They be trying to charge for the leather strap, man. They had $40. I wonder what the regular price is. What you think? No, it's 50. 49.50. I didn't see that. Well, yeah, right here. Oh, okay. Value was. So, Ralph had. They got a couple of shirts. Yeah, what y'all think about the shirts? I don't like polo shirts because a lot of times they don't fit too good. Which one did I get, babe? So, I finally found something that I wanted. Polo action, just a classic T polo. established 1967. Uh, I wish they still made polo jeans and polo sport. They don't make that much no more. I think jeans still exist. Um, wife don't want me to get no black shirts. I got too many, but they got the Fifth Avenue New York polo joint as well. Man, so I know a lot of people ask where I get my sunglasses at. And this, I know this is a sneaker channel, but I'm gonna answer some of the questions. I do this for the people, right, babe? I do this for the people. So I, the only sunglasses that really fit me, and I'm gonna show y'all the ones because I, I turned I turned around. But but these are Carreras right here. A lot of people ask what I wear. These are the only ones that fit my uh, face. My wife helped me out, and we could. I love sunglasses, but we could not find one that fit my face. Prados, I think it was a couple of pair of Prados that fit me good. But Carreras for the price, Carreras are the best. And um, let's try a couple of pair on, man. So try those black ones. Yeah, it's wrong with the gold around. I don't really like flashy, but no, the um third pair right there. Uh, I, can, I don't think I can get away with these. <laughs> you don't like them. Uh, <laughs> um, try the black ones right under those. I like those. They clean? Yeah, can you take that hat off? I'm sorry. Is it I mean, I'll hold it up so you can see yeah. the glass. Yeah. Is that better? Yeah, that's better. Okay. They all right. <laughs> she goes, she likes them. Then she said they all right. Under these? them. Mm -hmm. I really like these. Yeah, you don't have any blue ones. Yeah, these are my, this is my swag. Oh, yeah. You see? Yeah. Oh, that was dope. 
Yes, man. I got to put the hat down right quick. Why? Because I like it. I like the hat down, you know? Oh, you really like these? I really like those. Let me see the red ones, too. These are the same as that one, except they just red. Yeah. Fire. Yeah. I like these. Actually, I think I like these better because they got the gold in the middle. Mm. Just give it a little bow. Yeah. Oh, it's different from... The only red ones you got are those ones that I bought to go with those Ferraris. Yeah, man, so I think we got a winner. I don't have any sunglasses uh, this color. This is the same. Let me see. This is the same exact frame as the one I had on earlier. Or the one I've been wearing all day. So it has brown. It has a lighter tint on it so you can actually see my eyes. It had a gold hits. And it's on sale. How much is it? $99 with 40% off. $99 and 40% off? Mm -hmm. So these are going to be probably like 60 bucks, man. Easily. So I think we got a win. It was a couple more I like, but I think these, since I don't have any of this color, I think I'm going to go with these guys, man. So I got these from, what is this place? Solstice Sunglass Outlet. You buy sunglasses, man, go to the outlets, bro, because you're going to get the best prices instead of going to the department store. Am I right, babe? I agree. Exactly. So, uh, these seem like a cop. Yes, sir. Uh. Man, this dude just went to jail, man. For stealing. You know how many pairs of sunglasses they say he stole out of there, man? $6,000 worth. $6,000 worth of sunglasses he stole out of there and got caught. The police was like right by, and the girl went in there. And she just, she, she was able to catch the police to, um, uh, right on time. Uh, we enjoying Florida, me and wife out here. We came out here on a recommendation. We got a nice, um, what's the name of the thing we got? It's a townhouse. It's a townhouse. Very dope, very cleansed, very dope amenities. Recommendation for my guy C. Check out their YouTube channel. It's Miller Time TV. I will put the description below. The only reason I didn't vlog the actual uh, condo and stuff like that is because they already did it. So check out theirs. Very dope channel. Him and his wife. Me and my wife need to come up with another channel too. <laughs> we already got our movie channel, so y'all check that out. And um, I'll put the description on our movie channel below in the description too. Um, but check out them. They're just now starting, but they still a super dope couple. Yeah, they're just starting, yeah. but we hang with them. We cool with them. You might see them in our vlogs one day too, so vlog action. See, see them been in a couple of your vlogs. See, has been in my vlog, a couple of my vlogs. That's where you got those fives from. Yep. That's where I got my um, Laney fives from, C. And he's an avid shattered back bar, boy lover. And one day he's going to get him a pair of seats. Shout out to my homeboy. Uh, like I said, click those links below. Check out those channels. Uh, thanks Back for watching in the crib, man. Had to come home early because my babysitter uh, for my daughter was not feeling well. So I had to come home a day early. We left a day on the table out there in old Florida day. But, uh, and it's a lot of spots in Florida that we probably would have hit, but didn't get a chance to. That outlet didn't have anything as far as sneakers are concerned, but I did pick up a few items, and I'm going to go over them real quick with y'all. Y'all saw a couple of them in the video. Okay, Perfume Mania. I'm going to tell you like this, bro. I know this is a sneaker channel, but cologne, I like to smell good, bro. I like to, you know, I walk past you, I wonder, okay, he's, he's, he's he don't stink. But, <laughs> for real though. But, um, anyway... It, if you want to buy colognes or perfumes, go to an outlet. Um, do not go to a department store unless you like the gift bag they give you, the whole presentation. If you just want the cologne, if you just want the cologne itself, the liquid smell good, then go to um, go to the outlets, man. You're gonna get it a whole lot cheaper. Um, my wife, I was like, bro, I put a couple of scents on one of those cards they give you the smell, and because I, I wanted a new fragrance, I usually wear Izzy Miyake, but I've been wearing that so many years. I had uh, YSL, East Saint Laurent, um, and I lost that. I don't know where it is. I took it on vacation, and I have no idea where that cologne is. And Jay used the rest of my Izzy Miyake up, so I said, let me go with a new smell. I um, told her what I like the smell of. She gave me a couple of different choices, and then I went outside and let my wife smell them, and she was like, go with the Lacoste. So, this does smell quite good in my humble opinion. I've never worn Lacoste before. It's, it's a very good smelling cologne. Um, but the thing about cologne is it, smell, it might smell good on paper, but when you put it, some people, pheromones from the natural scent of their body don't go good with the cologne. So make sure you spray it on your skin before you buy cologne. That's it. That's my, my cologne commercial. But <laughs> it's Osis Sunglass Outlet. And I know in a lot of my videos, especially in the summertime, a lot of people ask where I get my sunglasses from, and I only wear one brand. I mean, it's a couple of other brands that I like. I like Gucci is, is okay as far as sunglasses. Prada is okay, but I like 
Carreras, man. Carreras are my favorite sunglass. And as y'all saw in the video, I go through a process. But <laughs> uh, the Carrera joints right here, they give you the case. And this is my first time getting a case like this right here. And then it has a little, like, Carrera tag down there as well. And I had to ask her for this little dust bag because I don't think it originally came with it. But I saw it sitting on the side. And I was like, let me get that dust bag. So you get the Carrera dust bag with a little Carrera right there on the tag. And the dust bag has a whole bunch of little Carrera logos. Very nice. Bow. Oh, that was upside down. Yeah, man. Woo. Woo. The glasses are dope, bro. Like these right here. The brown joints with the gold hits. The gold across the top right here. Man. Very nice. A very tiny Carrera logo right there. Y'all probably can't see that. Focus won't go that uh, deep. Anyway, man. These are dope. Very dope. Very dope. Put them on real quick. Lights are shining. Y'all see my lights in the background right here. These are fire, man. Like, I love sunglasses, especially when it gets started to get warm outside and the sun's all in your face, man. I just like, you know, I just like, hey, I don't know. I like shades. I've always been into sunglasses since I was younger, man. It's just something about a, a dope pair of shades. And I don't like cheap shades. I done bought a bunch of thousand pair of cheap shades when I was younger and I threw all them things in the trash can because the lenses get scratched real easy and they just they turn to trash very quickly but you know, so you want to spend some money but this right here this pair actually retailed at like almost $200 and I spent $60 because they had like mega sales going on throughout the whole store so I'm glad I was able to get these guys these the only this frame this wide frame Sunglass is the only one that fit my face right. I got a wide ass face apparently because every time I put a Gucci frame or something with a aviator or a small like round circle of frames on, it don't look right on my face. These rectangular wide frames is the only thing that I rock. I got like three pair of these. I also got these my wife bought me for my birthday last year. I need to wipe I need to wipe them off. I got a little dust on them. But she bought she bought my Ferrari. Oh, well, it was two years ago now. Yeah. She bought it was 2016. She bought my Ferrari. 14s and then she brought these sunglasses to go. I rarely wear these right here, man, but I like these too. I think they are quite cleansed in my humble opinion. Clank, clank on the shades, man. New pair too. New pair, get it. Clank, clank on the sunglasses. <laughs> cleansed stamp of approval on the sunglasses. This case says career on the inside too. Got that little suede kind of inside and it says career on the inside. Very nice. Very dope. Very cleansed in my also humble opinion. Um, oh, one more thing. And I showed y'all this in the store. I got my polo hat. My vintage looking polo hat with the um, flag on that guy. In the back, you got your leather strap. Which, it's hard to find polos with the leather strap on them. They used to make all of them with the leather strap. Um, very nice polo on the back. Got a wussy right there. Me and my wife. <laughs> Not horse. Wussy. Uh, right there. And um, this hat retailed at, this hat retailed at 50 bucks. I paid 39 not too bad. You know, a little, little outlet deal going on. I uh, got a t-shirt. Very similar to the hat. Hat is a little bit darker. As you can see, hat is like khaki and the shirt is like, um, the shirt is like sale. You know what I'm saying? So, y'all already know I rocked them sale ones with this. Very, very nice. There's another pair of sneakers I came up with in my mind to rock with this. I can't think of it. It was another pair of sneakers that I got that'll go perfect with this shirt and this hat. But, anyway... Some springtime action. Like I said, it would shoes was just scarce in there, so I was like, "Bro, I'm not going." Uh, if they had running shoes, like you said, it's perfect if you want to go for a jog or something like that. But they didn't have anything under that. I was really, really like, you know what? I must have these. But that's it. Those are my pickups. I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. I hopefully be going on some more vacations and getting some more of the vacation aspect in the vlogs. Um, as far as activities and stuff like that and then throw a little shopping in there too you know what i'm saying but anyway i hope y'all enjoyed it man y'all hit that thumbs up like subscribe all that good stuff hit the notification bell if you want to be a part of rich nation shout out to rich nation man shout out to all of y'all man rich nation stand up and keep watching my video because that's what i'm here for gone